All right, this is another one where you just basically want to follow the path. New. You have been captured, beast. You will be a survivor, or you will be food. All right, I hope one net is enough for actually, you know, yeah, it's probably not going to be enough. I must have time to gather my will. Do you not complete the animation unless I'm here, or did it take you that long to do two of them? Greetings, survivor. nets. Okay. Goodbye. <laughs> oh, these count. This one is captured. I now will take it. Very nice, okay. That worked out. Well, okay. Uh, all of these guys are a much lower level, so they're gonna be cleared out much faster. Says lightning damage, elemental damage. And I guess this one is technically better. Am I even blocking? All right, 88 versus. Oh no, I kind of need the sockets. All right, I'll put you away for now. Yes, I know. Press X. Got it. Except that it's it, the actual graphic is bugged. Interesting. Okay, so uh, arcane surge. We'll do this, and we're gonna do this. Bam. Okay. What do I do with the fan? Oh, the faster casting. Okay, okay, that's the thing we gotta go into to kill the beast, which is what we're gonna do. Extra life, enduring cry. been making mistakes along the way. Don't worry, we'll fix that. Oh, yes. Those. Oh, it's the spider. I must have time to gather my will. This one is captured. Oh, you gotta do the animation every time. Oh, no, come on. Don't do this to me. Okay. That's the exit, which means... I have two nets. This better work. I now will take the captured beast to the menagerie. Alright. Uh, I need more nets. Greetings. Okay, good. <laughs> oh, Haku's in here. Oh, no, the lag. God damn it. No, I gotta walk back. Okay. 
coming, Haku. Don't worry. Don't worry, buddy. Tala Moana, warrior. Tala Moana to you too. A lost warrior, language. Dude, he's in there, bro. You gotta get him out. Bumble way Chumba. Please use the net. Use the net. Use the net on the wrong thing. Oh crap. That lag, man. Now I gotta buy more. Survivor. You are well prepared for the end. This is a fine capture. Hello. Okay. See you, Survivor. Extra life. Do that. More life. Yeah, buddy. But yeah, totems can do that sometimes. It's pretty funny when they teleport. I can't kill actually. Yeah. Oh no, I can. Look at that. As you honor the answer, you get more reputation with me the more stuff you do. Oh, actually, I should actually go out the way I came in because it dumps me really far away otherwise. Oh, come on. Please. Please don't do this to me. Come on. I just... Just let me do it. Come on. Ooh, okay, this is another master. I really like Over her. She spawns stuff fine. on the map. I have a certain oh. pack of vermin oh, in mind. Done that. A truly twisted and ravenous lot. They range across quite a large territory, so be prepared to cover some ground. Hunt them down wherever they might be and put an end to them. To help you out, I'm going to share a little trick with you. A bit of thaumaturgical tracking that I picked up during my time here in Rayclast. If your quarry is nearby, it'll point you in their direction. The whole thing stinks of corruption, I know. But sometimes you have to behave like the animal you want to kill. Okay, well, I, I, I just want to say this about her. While her quests are really great, she's the type of girl that, like, doesn't believe in deodorant. You know what I'm talking about? So, uh, you know, your mileage of how much you'll enjoy the character may vary. This land is crawling with vermin. Eight-legged, no-legged, and everything in between. Life here has become twisted and hateful, and it's eating Rayclast alive. Unless we do something about it. Unless we clear away this infestation, nature doesn't stand a chance while it has creatures like that at its throat. You want to make an impression around here? I have a certain pack of. Okay. Right. Well, we got two pieces of lore, and since we're nearby, I guess we'll go do it. 
I'm down. Infected. Uh, so you get this little arrow, and then you, you go kill the mobs. Um, it'll, there's a lot of variations on that, so... Uh, sometimes you'll have to find where they live, and sometimes you'll find that first, and then, you know, you already did it. So, always do them. Flame totem. them. Etchings on wood. Oh, but my shrine buffs are gonna wear off. I haven't slept. No one has slept. Not for three days, not since the black storm in the northern ranges. Not since the nightmares began. Violent and twisted night terrors. They whisper to us, tempt us, threaten us, beguile us. They promise terrible things in return for even more terrible acts. My husband, Daenerys, went to Alliston to find a doctor who might help. He should have been back yesterday. I fear for him. I fear for all of us. It has been a little over a week since the Black Storm. My husband has not returned, and sickness now sweeps through our village. Many have died, and those who have lived have... changed. These were folk we once called neighbor and friend. Now they limp and stagger through the night, their deformities as grotesque as the madness in their eyes. Okay, so the way the crossroad works is it's a crossroad, you pick one of your directions. The last place we'll be going is uh, over here. That's where Creighton is, it's, uh, it's where the last piece of the necklace will be, and then we'll get our two passive skill points. But that comes last. I want to get the, the waypoints first. I get the waypoints up here. Then I'm going to get the waypoint down there. Those don't count as beasts, really? And then, uh, oh, I guess I, I'll, I'll handle that later. I just want to get the waypoint. Chamber of Sins. Waypoints, like, right here. Uh, you just, you got to get to the center. The lair of a toy maker with pretensions of godhood. Uh, the Templar is very religious. Uh, I, just, I just thought you guys should know that. See, like, it's, it's right there. Oh, there's a master mission. Come to me, exile. Let us speak of death. That arena Life is my least favorite master. This land must At take least its in terms of uh, so that it can stuff rise works. once again in undying perfection. I honor the darkness with my art to prove that I am worthy of a place in its dream made reality. To the blind of sight and numb of touch, my sculpture may seem complete. Far from it. Like a raw and chewy steak, it requires marinating, and not with any mundane cooking concoction. My sculpture must be steeped in the delectable juices of deathly corruption. Only then will it be palatable to my undying patron. Today, you and I shall devote ourselves to the pursuit of art. There is no greater cause. My sculpture complains that it is thirsty, and yet the usual fare seems not to satiate it. However, I believe I have a solution. Find a pack of living creatures, slaughter them, raise them, and bring them back here. Be selective, though, as these creatures must be absolutely fecund with corruption. Thankfully, they will be easy to spot. The most corrupted usually are. Okay. Basically, her stuff involves go over here, get a bunch of stuff, and then bring it back with you. The reason why her quest is annoying is because they don't, the, the mobs don't, like, teleport to you. You gotta, like... You gotta slowly walk with them. Thankfully, we only have to do two, but it will get worse. I promise. But uh, this will be over fast. And then I want to get back and do Tora's mission. So. And of course, these have life regen. Because of course they do. Then you just click on the green circles on the ground, and then, come on. Then they. I mean, they're fast now, but once you start stacking movement speed, you're gonna be like, ugh, why are they so slow? Okay. Really? You've completed my errand, Exile? Forgive my surprise, but I'm simply not used to reliability from the living. The dead are loyal beyond question, but the living, they have their own needs and lusts, fears and fancies. Easily distracted they are. I compliment you on your powers of concentration, Exile. And should you note my presence in the forest encampment, do engage me in discourse. I am sure I can make use of that keen focus of yours again. Okay, well. Uh, 
At the end of the day, her... Come on. No, don't do this. I didn't click on the... Okay. At the end of the uh, day, her uh, crafting thing that you can do is not very important, so she's one of the last people I invite to my uh, domain. But... Um, oh. uh, you still should do them. I don't know if I'm going to max her. I don't know if I'm going to max out anybody this playthrough, because I don't really use the crafting all that much. Uh, I mostly just pay for what I want. Uh through like grinding and stuff so it's a good way to play i gotta say if you're if you can make money quickly you can just pay for whatever you want i'm not the best at it but uh i live within my means come on blitz killer let's do it there we go oh my spirit shield lucky me That's the boss. So I still need to find more after this. Okay. Thankfully, I'm very high above these levels uh, for the mobs, so I don't really need to worry too much about that. Come on. Sometimes this is a really absurd number for such a low level, and thank. But thankfully, the the master you will teleport that? to you when you're done. That's the sound of nature taking its first decent breath in far too long. The more vermin we turn into fertilizer, the more nature can breathe and grow in peace. Come see me when you're next in the forest encampment. I can always use a good color. Really hate the way she says color. But I really like the Jukuba movement speed on belt, so she's uh, she's pretty good. And her quests are really easy to do. And have, like, no downsides. Oh, okay. Well, I guess I would have missed this if it wasn't for anything, so. Oh, only contains support gems. Alright, let's hope that they have quality. Ooh, okay. This is Rogue Exile. Sometimes Rogue Exiles are, will just be with groups of mobs or appear from things, and they always drop, like, a full set of armor. Because that's what they're wearing or something. I don't know. Remote mine, ruthless, chance to bleed, added fire, void manipulation. Okay, that would have been great if it had quality on it. It doesn't, so let's just keep going. Okay, well, we're not going north first, though. I do want to click on that lower nether we're here, so. Oh! Hello, Bravalo. Bravalo. The moon was full the night of the black storm. It is full again. They have come for me. They have come for my daughters. Bravalo called out while the others skulked and muttered in the darkness. Corrin went to them, arms open, welcoming. The nightmares told her to. My uncle tried to stop her. Bravalo crushed his skull with his smith's hammer. I barred the doors and windows, but they screamed like monkeys and beat themselves bloody trying to get in. I had no choice. I took my two youngest and fled through the cellar, following the tunnel to the mill. All we can do is hide and hope. God help us. Oh, you gonna die. Three Lunari gone now since it all began. Perhaps I am the only one who still looks upon Lunaris, who remembers her name. Soon, I will be gone, and the moon will go on alone. My husband has returned, and he hunts for me. My dead husband hunts me. Corrin, too, and my uncle. Corpses rise and walk and feed. My girls, they walk now and feed. God has forsaken us. Lunaris is my witness. Tonight, I return to my family. Uh, I don't know what that means. Oh well. To the Fail Shrine Ruins. 
this place is pretty easy to get to as well. So let's just go do that. I must have time to gather my will. Now this one makes you bigger. We gonna get bigger. Please click on the shrine. Thank you. There's one thing I would improve in this game, other than the fact that uh, skills should be. You should be able to choose which skills you want to cast standing still and cast, uh, you know, walk to the area and then cast it. Um, it would be that the radius at which you pick things up needs to be bigger. Come on. No. Time to come back. Where is he? Okay, so they do just summon more. Alright, cool. Well, I hope I have enough nets. If I don't have enough nets, I'm gonna have to use that portal scroll I dropped. They dropped a strong net. Where is he? Come on. There we go. Guess I'm gonna need strong nets from now on. The first ones look upon this capture with pride, exile. Yeah, you hunt good. well. Do you want to say anything? No, all right, good. So far, I'm not really digging the whole net mechanic. There's gotta be like more nets. I don't know, I think one net would have been just fine. Maybe I'll change my mind at the end game, we'll see. Yeah, all you gotta do is follow the path of the, the Veil Shrine. So, like, this, this path right here with the rocks. Just follow it. It'll be good. If you see, like, an angel-looking dude that's all, like, glowing and shit with claws coming out to hit you, you're in the right spot. Also, the clumps of enemies here are really nice. This used to be the spot to, uh, to grind and level up. Please, thank you. Alright. I'm just straight up lagging at this point. Ugh. Alright, well. We're almost on our way. I appear to have lost the path. No, 
movement speed is nice, but no thank you. Here we go. Every time I pause, it, it just gets really nervous. On this day, the second Socrato of the Rusi, 1334 IC, the Army of Purity remembers its most devout and beloved servant, Archbishop Joffrey of Frisia. As spoken by Joffrey, only will and truth can prevail over the evil of our own kin. High Templar Vol, Commander of the Army of Purity. Okay, Lightning Gems, Spell Damage, Attack Speed, which is not really what I need. Adding Lightning Damage to Spells is pretty cool, though. Uh, eh, it doesn't have the right sockets. On the flip side, it does have the right sockets for that. Okay. All right. Do wanting now, boys, which is what we're going to be doing in the future.